Matt Wood is an American comedian, prankster, vlogger, and film director who was born and raised in Millersport, Ohio. Considering he and his wife Brittany document a lot of their home life with their kids on YouTube, you likely know they've stayed in Ohio, living in a big house in Columbus for many years. More recently, after taking some time off, the fam upgraded to a bigger mansion and just showed it off. I think it's time we compare the Atwoods properties. Roman Atwood has been producing videos since he was in high school, first creating comedy content on a YouTube channel dubbed Sketch Empire in late 2009. A year earlier, Roman had met Britney Smith at a wedding of a close friend. They started dating and in 2011, they had their first son, Kane, followed by their daughter, Cora, in 2017. You make a wish, you can rub foreheads, rub noses, but if you want to have a real good time, you do all three. <laughs> the two were married in 2018 in Maui, Hawaii, and eventually grew to a family unit of six with the birth of their most recent child, Knox, and the inclusion of Roman's son, Noah, from a previous marriage. Over the years, Roman and his family have built a swarm of loyal fans with over 26 million subscribers spread across two different YouTube channels. While Roman Atwood was his first channel and dedicated largely to his pranks, <laughs> More recently, his focus has been on the channel Roman Atwood Vlogs that shows his family's home life on a regular basis. What are we doing? Jumping jacks. Jumping jacks. Jumping jacks. Oh, <laughs> uh, you lost. I didn't say. She don't even know. Over the course of 2020, the Atwoods content became more intermittent. This led to many of their fans expressing worry over their sudden disappearance and hoping that the family was safe. Roman and Brittany then posted a video to YouTube that explained why they hadn't been around as much as they used to be. And the reason was intense. We've been dealing with some extremely scary stalkers. Extreme harassment. This stalking experience led the couple to abandon their content for most of the year to keep their family safe. They turn the power off to our home. This home, they have turned they turn the power off in the middle of the winter. Like we have kids. Like someone even sent them creepy pictures taken from their own home security system. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. I want you to imagine that you have to have a funeral for somebody that you love. These stalkers bomb threaded funeral. Thankfully, with a little help from the FBI, the Atwoods got control of the situation and they're getting ready to launch chapter three of their lives by moving into a brand new home. What's happening guys and girls, it's Kara here for you with an updated house tour on the homes of Roman and Brittany Atwood. Considering the stalker drama and all the family has been through, we're respecting their privacy about the new place, but we do have a full look inside, which is enough to see how luxurious the home is. We'll look at the Atwoods' former residence too, and you guys can compare for yourself. Be sure to subscribe to Famous Entertainment if you're new and ring that bell for notifications because we post a new video daily. Follow me over on Instagram to chat and now let's get into this video. Roman bought this gigantic estate back in 2014 for a reported $349,000. And once you take a look at this place, I'm pretty sure you'll agree with me that it was a huge deal. Not long after moving in, Roman constructed a whole new backyard space that must have set him back more than he paid for the property in the first place. He also installed a gigantic rec area out front that's surrounded by a white picket fence where his kids could play all day long if the mood strikes. But the best feature of this entire property has got to be the lakefront it boasts in the back where Romans installed an epic water slide. Moving to the inside, Romans original home had two bathrooms and three bedrooms, including a couple of fun kid inspired rooms for the youngsters. When you enter the front door, you're immediately greeted by a stairway that leads up to the top floor. Besides the bedrooms upstairs, there's also an open space at the top of the steps that makes for a perfect family room where everyone can hang out. Downstairs, the kitchen and living room are combined together in an open concept style space. If you look up while standing in the living room, you can see the balcony to the upstairs that encircles the family room. Since moving in that home, Roman added a number of features to the living room, including a wall-mounted aquarium and a whole ton of equipment for roughhousing with the kids. The kitchen has a gigantic island in the middle as well as top-of-the-line stainless steel appliances. But more importantly, there's a ton of space for non-cooking related activities. The former Atwood home was full of open space, which makes sense since Roman used to film his content from here, even when he installed an indoor rock climbing 
retaining wall in the middle of the living room. While this spot was impressive and spacious, the Atwoods made quite the upgrade. A few weeks ago, Roman returned to Instagram where he posted an update to his fans that his family recently built themselves a brand new home. And he also gave us all a peek. I mean, do you guys see that front entry? It's amazing. Wait, hold on, there's an even better look at it now. Thanks to the video of the home he just posted on his YouTube channel. That double staircase entryway looks like it belongs back in colonial times, especially when paired with that white and black finishing and classy chandelier. While Romans posted a look at his new place, he's smarter this time after past situations to not show every detail off. Instead, he goes over the highlights like this deluxe kitchen. Featuring stainless steel appliances, a gigantic dining room table, a marble island bigger than most kitchens, and classic white finishing, this kitchen has it all, even down to its own drinking fountain. Well, sort of. Off to the side, there's also a well-organized walk-in pantry, which is pretty much a necessity when your family is as big as theirs. Both Roman and Brittany picked their own favorite room to show off in their new digs. For Brittany, that meant displaying her jaw-droppingly large and fully stocked walk-in closet. The closet even contains its own vanity mirror and makeup table at the far end, which ensures Brit can do all of her glamming up in here. For Roman's fave room, it's his brand new music studio, which has enough space for an entire stage, drum set, and a whole bunch of high-end speakers. As I mentioned, Roman and his family have lived in Ohio most of their lives. For obvious reasons, they haven't let us know the location of their new house because, I mean stalkers. Privacy issues are something that more and more social media stars are going to have to learn how to deal with over the next few years. Even like what happened to David Dobrik and fans breaking into his home. But the Atwoods aren't giving up yet and they've promised to eventually show us more of their brand new place while inspiring others. As far as I'm concerned, I think the Atwoods needing to move became a blessing in disguise. I mean, look at their new mansion. I would say that's a silver lining. After checking out Ryan and Brittany Atwood's homes, including their former family home and brand new mansion, which was your fave? What were your favorite features? Be sure to let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to continue the chat or let me know some other YouTuber homes we should take a look at here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.